lights even hit your eyes. Romano, he can send it down there, that strong left arm of his. But will Lozere to all those on the other side because he's been playing in Italy. In 2019. Mosca. What about Rinaldi with that serve? With a big lead because then you're playing catch up and that for a young and experienced team trying to blood and find a soul as you say is difficult so that's a, a reassuring point there trying to find their gel this is the first competition meaningful that they've had with their national teams all season lima cool as you like oh fantastic and that's what italy will be playing on and that surely has got to worry argentina claire hannah we're watching italy against argentina the opening match in ottawa and at the moment, the world champions, the European champions, looking good. The Romano Ooh. is the reason why they're looking good. There's an absolute belter across the net again. Oh, lovely touch. Well read by Mosca. Romano winds himself up. But the Checo. Now to Lima. Another great dig from Rinaldi. And again. Oh, oh. what a block. <laughs> you think about this huge block all being led by Polanco again one of the younger wing hitters one Decheco pointed out as saying 16 trophies in 12 years phenomenal success and then topping it with an Olympic bronze medal big swing again for Romano and he'll take that off the hands oh is that in it is ace thank you Augustin Lozère, first ace of the day. There's nowhere to be seen. Or pardon me, Cortesia. Oh! How about that for a setter? <laughs> I think that's the first kill Poro has had. Ginelli would have been happy with that one. Look at this. What a time to go. Zeba, goes to the jump serve. That's off the hands from Romano. Not quite the exuberance that greeted the previous point. And now on serve. Got an ace already. Oh, oh it's another no. one. That's Recine. Oh, just out. Let's see. Playing his volleyball now back home in Argentina. Oh, you could feel that from where we are. Yeah. Block. They're ready again. Porro's up there. Cortesia has been quiet, as you haven't mentioned him. And here's Romano. He's been anything quiet. He's causing a real noise in the st Well, it might be a rookie status for them. They're doing it together. European champions is under 21 level, the two of them. They were part of that Italian team, which has given such a rich seam of talent. He's had two seasons in Italy, and there's a bit of rivalry ashore. And of course, these two teams go back to Tokyo 2020 oh. as well, when Italy went down 3-2. Five wow. sets, spectacular. Danani, I thought it was over. Subscription. You want to watch this again, because this is a fantastic match so far. Lovely swing again, and it's that man, Mosca. And it's back to one. You're Argentina. <laughs> Big hit, but another great block, and it's that man, Lozere, once more. But he's been such a key element in this. Oh, just it's in. I thought it was. Oh, it just snuck in. Nice work by Rinaldi. Romano tried to go through. Absolutely no way through. Is this Lee? Lead at the moment by three points, and that's another wonderful swing. Trying to make something different as Argentina continue to lead. And that's another point that's leaked away by it. And off the hands. It isn't four. Tallest on the team. Gallego. Ooh, even that's too much. Recine takes that. Esta recepción, señor, y salimos. Atento a las variaciones. Sí, atento a las variaciones, atento. Goes to the float, Danani reads it. Luzer, take that. Take the second set. And Argentina lead 25-23. How are they still there, wanting it in adversity? 
because as we know in sport as much as life you find yourself and you find how good or strong you are at outside hitter he's got a lot of experience good server as well world champion outside hitter and still he's sticking with Lecine but maybe there's a reason for that but you want to see a player fight that's yeah, what he's that. saying will he step up to this challenge Whoa. What a good over Mosca Vicentin, Decheco, Lima. Another point. Yeah, this is going back and forth. He looks a bit revved, I've got to say. Yeah. And it's proving to be the case, and it's reflected in the scoreboard. Here we go again, Decheco. Oh, he's changed the tack. Now that was clever by Palonski. Captain Decheco gets us underway once more. Mosca. Has he missed one yet? I don't think so. And I also don't think he's hit to any other position. He ranked two. They're bridging the gap big time. Now it's the little things that Dicheco does. Ronaldo, not Recchini. And he's straight in the action, trying to keep it in play, and that's another ace. 30-28 to Italy to close out the match 3-1. Very different now. Oh, he's done something different, Moscow. I, I, but he still wins the point. That's the key. Oh, yes. Your man, Recchini. He never back. doubted him. He's back, baby. Does that happen in set three when you've taken the first two? Inside to the finish and foot off the gas. Not there. Why his time? Is that just barely crept over the net? Smart work, quick thinking by Bortolo. Back with the net. Vicentin's not the greatest pass, but let's see if Lima can make hay. Oh, this has got to go over. He's got stuck on 13 or 14 points for a long time. One says he was leading it till his charge. Vicentin comes to the party in the under 21s or under 22s. But when you get to big boys, volleyball as you might say Paolo Poro is finding out what it's like because he's great in Italian league but this is another level altogether and the likes of Dicecco and Lima and Moser Dicecco what a lovely beautiful how did he do that going one way the ball goes the other and Lima does the rest to keep Italy in the match Dicecco big booming hits and Argentina close out this match 25-18. A clean sweep of the world champions and the European champions. Argentina have sent a message to the rest of the men's VNL. We're ready and we're